I'm trying to make it so it holds the dress, Melissa. You guys doing on your left hand? Like the grip? Alright guys, so I'll be showing you a few things you can use from your house. Just from your house at a wedding. So everything here you can probably find in your house. If you don't have these things in your house, then you should have these things in your house. Seal tape. Seal tape, scotch tape, whatever you want to call it, comes in handy a lot at a wedding. You have to throw some seal tape in your bag. You have to throw this in your camera bag. Because um, you can use it for like a lot of things, but usually, um, I had a wedding yesterday, and um, the, the bride's dress kept falling off of um, the, the hood and hanger that she had. So, um, I'll show you a clip of that because uh, I told my my assistant to record me but the, the 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 dress kept falling off so I was like okay here's a trick that I know you get a seal tape you um you kind of like um you get the hanger and you put it on the hanger in the shoulders where the dress is gonna go and after that the dress is not gonna fall anymore so you can put the dress outside or wherever you want to put it but trust me the dress is not gonna fall off that hanger once you put the uh, the seal tape in the in there I'll, I'll show you a clip of this just to so you can see so yeah so seal tape comes in handy not just for the hanger there's a lot of things that you can use um, that that uh, you can use for tape you know so seal tapes gonna come in handy there you go so another thing that um that's always in my bag is the Allen key so this is an allen key but this is uh it, it has a whole lot of sizes so i got this i think from uh home depot or walmart i don't know where i got it from but anyways allen keys come in handy because most of us like um our camera cages our camera uh the rig has some type of um allen key or the tripod sometimes so you need an allen key to adjust those um those screws on your tripods and on your camera on your camera cages you know camera rig and all that so you need an allen key it comes in handy i mean you might not use it every time you go to a wedding but let's say sometimes you've been using your tripod um i have a manfrotto tripod so sometimes it comes loose so um there's this one time when i had to uh tighten it at the like right before a ceremony you know right before a ceremony i had to i had to tighten the tripod and i didn't have an allen key and uh uh thank god i was at a hotel so i went uh uh, I, was at, I was at a hotel and I went to the front desk and I was like, oh, um, you guys have a handyman because I saw somebody like, you know, fixing stuff. So like, oh, you guys have a handyman. Do you know if he has an Allen key? They're like, oh, yeah. One of the ladies took me to um, the, the, the handyman's uh, office and this dude had a whole bunch of tools in there. And um, he was like, oh, bring your tripod. Let me see. Let me try. And uh, actually, he tightened it up. So uh the more the the reason of the story is you need an Allen key because you never know, you know, when your thing is gonna go loose or what part of it is gonna go loose so you need an allen key so yeah allen key comes useful so another thing is um that you can use from your house that you can find in your house uh rubber bands you know they're so simple yet they got a lot of a lot of uh purpose to them you know they they this is like a multi-purpose uh accessory right here you know, I mean, you can use it for your shirt. Like, let's say you're wearing a shirt and your shirt keeps coming down. You can, you know, pop that rubber band there. And anyways, mainly what I use rubber bands for at weddings, I use them to do this right here. To, um, to put, to organize my cables, you know, just, there's a lot of loose cables and you want to be neat. You want to be as neat as you can. So that way you, it's, it makes it easy for you to find things when you are organized because, being an organized is you know is you, you don't want to be unorganized you want to know where everything is you want to have a separate bag for all your batteries a separate bag for all your cables that go um that have to do with audio a separate bag for uh cables that have to do with you know the drone is you know so you need um you need to be neat you need to organize your stuff and uh rubber bands that's an accessory that you can use to organize your stuff so rubber bands you can find these in your house if you don't have these in your house go to your local store convenience store you probably find a dollar store you can find a bag of these just buy a bag of these and get a few and throw them in your camera bag 
so yeah rubber bands so um another thing that you can find in your house that you can use at weddings is this right here this is a ziploc bag right here so usually you know this is found in the kitchen for sandwiches for you know meat or food you want to eat later or whatever uh so you can use this at a wedding usually um i use this for cables you know i use this to store all my cables to organize all my cables let's say um this is where this is where i'm gonna put all my audio stuff in so i put all my audio cables in here my love mics and all that stuff and my uh you know quarter inch and stuff like that so instead of buying a fancy bag online somewhere or somewhere around your in in a store you can just get a uh k uh you can just get a box of ziploc bags you know and just um have it to just like store your stuff and you can you know it's got uh you can find this in your house i'm sure your mom or whoever or you got this in your house the other thing that you can use at a wedding is um that you can find in your house is a hanger usually what i do is i get a hanger i get a nice brown hanger or whatever and i put it in my uh in my car so just in case the bride doesn't have a nice hanger you can just go i, I just go in the car and get that hanger and uh use it for her dress because you know you don't want to have a cheap looking plastic wire hanger for the wet for the dress some brides actually forget to do these things and some are actually maybe cheap to do this but you want a nice hanger to make your videos look good so you can bring a hanger a, a, a nice hooded hanger that you can use or a black hanger that you can use for the wedding dress so so that way it looks good in your videos you know yeah so another accessory is uh the bobby pin the hair pin you know my wife just told me it's called a bobby pin so yeah you can use a bobby pin in place of these uh lav mic in case they break i have a lot of them break so i always have bobby pins in my bag just in case something happens to my uh the clips of my um my lav mic throw a few bobby pins in your bag because one day these things will come in handy not just for the mic but you know you never know man there's going to be sometimes just one knee there's just going to be that one time when you need something and uh you're gonna be like wait i got something like that in my bag or i got something like that in my car because um you you came prepared so always be prepared and always have these accessories that you can use in case of emergencies yep so these bobby pins come in handy that's the stuff that you can find in your house that you can bring with you to a wedding that will come handy and one bonus um tip too as well um is a shoelace if you uh wear dress shoes and you have shoelaces a shoelace can come in handy at a wedding and i'll show you a video of how i used a shoelace i actually um i was at a wedding and i had i didn't I, there was no way to hook this dress up you know i tried by all means what i could like there was no way to hook this dress up so i took one of my shoelaces off tied it around a thing there and i hang the the bride's dress on it so i'll show you um that as well so you can use your shoelace sometimes to you know hook it up somewhere and and put the bride's dress there so yeah so those are things that you can find in your house or that you can get for cheap so hopefully you found um this video useful and uh thank you for watching thank you for subscribing and if you haven't subscribed yet please feel free to subscribe if you find my uh my videos my content valuable to you so thank you for watching i really appreciate it and it's francis and i'll see you in the next video